Hello everyone, Lori Carter coming to you from my office in Casadega Spiritualist Camp. Hope you're doing well. I have to tell you that that energy has just been so heavy lately. Are you all feeling it? I mean, last week was the heaviest for me. And you know, it was just after the hurricane that came through and you know, it discombobulates everyone. And oh, I am so praying for those who have gone through the hardest and continue to go through it. It's not easy. I've been there with hurricanes and apparently, you know, there's always something out there turning, <laughs> getting ready to head this way. And so one day I was really feeling the heavy energy, like I said, and the next day I realized that it was an eclipse energy. And I'm like, wow, that really made a lot of sense to me. You know, and then as I'm thinking about all of this, you know, and the elections are coming up, not that this is a political post of any stretch of the idea because I wouldn't go there. But the point is, I do feel that the energy is, it, it is, it's good versus less than good. That's how I really feel about it. I'm not really sure if it's true or not. All I can do is raise my own vibration. All any of us can do is raise our own vibration, thinking good thoughts, love, joy, um, peace, and trying to stay in that energy and then maybe meditating a little bit to share your vibrations with the whole because if it truly is about good and less than good we light workers have the power and the strength to send the highest and best for all involved. So please, when you wake up in the morning, I know it sounds silly, maybe to some of you, but when you wake up in the morning before you even crawl out of bed, you know, gather up your energy, think positive thoughts, and send it to the world, you know? And when we all work on this together, think of what we can do, seriously. It's pretty big. And so here's the card draw for today. We're using the Spirit Oracle cards right here. Haven't used these in a while. By Tony Carmine Salarino. And we actually have a bonus card, which is really fun. Um, let me see here. Which card came out? Here it is, right here. This card came out first. So pick one, two, or three. Here's number one. Responsibility. Do what feels right for you above all else. It is impossible to please all parties in the present situation. You have responsibility only for your life and actions. Others must take responsibility for themselves. If you chose number two, here we go. Innocence. Innocence, purity, joy. You are being encouraged to just be you. You are a light of joy in this world. Expect positive outcomes to flow from your honesty and pure intentions. And if you chose number three, Electra. Very neat looking cards as well. Electricity, thunderbolt, activation. You are subconsciously connecting with the awesome power that lies in the energy of the stars. Intergalactic transmission from a place beyond time. A message is coming. Be open-minded. And as I said, we do have a bonus card for everyone. A place beyond time is what it is. Isn't, aren't these beautiful cards? I just love them. There we go. Do not get so caught up with the everyday drama of life. Close your eyes, focus on your breath, and allow it to carry you into a peaceful space inside your heart. 
an eternal place beyond time, filled only with love. So I hope it was helpful for y'all today and have a great week.